Daddy, you're billionaires, so I know it's going to be a hundred... Five? Honey! Quiet. I just want to know one thing. Why is our rich score so low? Sweetie, I've gone bankrupt. Bankrupt? But, Daddy, you're a billionaire. He made a bad investment. I'm sorry, honey. <sighs> well, what are we supposed to do now? Just live like peasants? I can't let anyone know about this. Why is your score private? It's just so high that I, I don't want to make other people jealous. Please let us see your score. No, you're being sus. Mommy, Daddy, we have a huge problem. What? What? Well, you remember my super rich friend Ashley? The one who's friends with Elon Musk? Mm -hmm. Well, her daddy is in charge of these richness score scales, and she said she's going to have him make our percentage score public. I'm sorry, Pumpkin. I know this is hard. Why are my Gucci shoes in a for sale box? If we sell them, our percentage could go up. Okay, do what you must, because my social status is on the line. Good news, someone bought them on eBay. It only went up 2%. That wasn't worth it. I want my Gucci shoes back. Why did you have to go bankrupt, Daddy? Now tomorrow I'm going to be publicly humiliated. I can't stand to see her like this. The truth is, Daddy didn't actually go bankrupt. You lied to me? Yes, because we didn't want you to worry. About what? Recently, some bad men threatened to take you away from us if we didn't pay them billions. And you listened to them? I had to. Daddy, I would think you would know better. This isn't a joke, Pumpkin. I know these men. They would really come for you. Enough. Have they received the money? The transfer is still pending, but this is why our score is so low. Cancel that transfer. If I do that, they're going to get really upset. Cancel it right now, Daddy, or... Or I'm gonna scream. Okay, alright, it's cancelled. We have a hundred percent? I can't wait to show the girls. It's not safe for you to be out in public right now. Daddy, I will be fine. Just hire me some bodyguards. Your score is going public in three, two... <gasps> what? You have a hundred percent? Aw, and it looks like you both are only in the 90s. <sighs> Miss, we need to get you out of here. We have a code red. Who's that man behind you? Brooke, run! Oh. Todd, how dare you? He was my favorite bodyguard. Are you Brooke Evans? Um, no. Take a... Let me go, you jerks. Read this. I am not reading that. Yes, you will. Hi, Daddy. This is Brookie. Unfortunately, I have been kidnapped, and... I'm sorry, can we cut? The lighting is just so bad. Just read the script. Okay, jeez. Hi, Daddy. They are saying that they want 1.2... I can't read that. Ugh. What? I don't have my contacts. All right, that's enough. Ow. Send us the money, or you're not going to see her again. You better not have ripped out my hair. Be quiet, or we're going to get the duct tape. I'm hungry. Can you guys get me some Starbucks or something? Who do you think we are, Uber Eats? Back to being a peasant. Okay, guys, they transferred the money. Now let me go. Change of plans. <laughs> We're bringing you to a new location. But that wasn't the deal. Someone else gave us a better offer for you. Hey, Brooke. Todd, you're... Shh, quiet. They're asleep. Huh? Hey, what do you think you're doing? Get back. You don't want to mess with me. I'm an ex-Navy SEAL. What's that supposed to mean, huh? It means he's going to kick your ass. I'd like to see him trouble. <laughs> yes, Todd, get them. <laughs> <laughs> Miss, would you be interested in this one? She's in desperate need of a foster mom. No one wants to foster her. Why not? Because she does things like... Like that. I'd be willing to care for her. But I want double the pay. Deal. I'm going to work. Waffles are in the freezer. What is her deal? Why is she always staring at me? She needs to get a life. Hey, that's not nice. Huh? I didn't say anything, you freak. Guys, her label's appearing. <gasps> freak! I knew it! Excuse me, are you Vanessa Hart? Code 22? I need you to come with me. Please, let me out. Don't bother. The glass is soundproof. I didn't even see you there. Most people don't. What's your name? My name's Casey. I've been here for a long time. 
Your label, it's the same as mine. Yep, I have a power. So where are we? A lab owned by a man named Damien. He's obsessed with kids like us. What's your power? Well, I have, um, telepathy, telekinesis, and- Hold on, you have more than one? Yeah, why? Because that's- They're coming. Who's coming? The boss wants to see you. Good luck. Hello, Vanessa. I've been looking for you. Your powers won't work in this room. Don't worry. You'll be using them shortly. I'll prepare her for testing. What? No! Subject is Vanessa Hart, age 16, and it looks like her birthday is tomorrow. I'll get you a gift if you're a good listener today. I'm turning 17 tomorrow, not 7. Feisty! If you don't behave, though, there's consequences. I know you have three powers, and one of them is telepathy. That's your foster mom. Tell me where she is. What do you see? I see water, and I see trees. She's at a beach. Excellent. Yes, we had her sent on a little vacation. I'll get her hooked up to the machine, boss. This is amazing. Telekinesis is such a cool power. I want to see her lift something heavier. I want you to lift this 500-pound weight. No, I can't. I need to see how strong you are. Do it. She's lifting it. Okay, enough. Uh, boss, her nose. She's fine. Casey? Vanessa, I was really worried about you. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm feeling better all of a sudden. How did that happen? I used my powers on you. I healed you. <sighs> you did? Yeah, my power is healing. And you look like you needed some help. Thanks, no one's ever been so- Happy birthday, Vanessa. Come with me. I have a surprise for you. Okay, let's see you. Wow, what do you think, Mason? She looks great, sir. I got you some food. You can eat. Go ahead. Does it taste good? See, Vanessa? It's not so bad here. I can take care of you. You see, you have three powers, which makes you one of a kind. And together, we can make such a good team. I can become your new parent. Were you in my head? They're here. Vanessa, wait! Mom. Dad. <sighs> Your powers won't work on that. It's protected. Open the door. Vanessa, hey, listen. You know I can't do that. <gasps> Mason, the lights! Turn on the lights! <gasps> yes, sir. Sorry, Vanessa. Mason, come look at this. Want me to fix the light, sir? No, Mason. The light's not broken. This is her doing this. But she has a power dampener on. How could she do that? Her powers are stronger than that device. Turn on the red lights. All the way. Wait, isn't that gonna hurt her? Why do you care? Don't tell me you have feelings for her. No, of course not. I'll be right back. Vanessa, wake up. Vanessa, it's me, Mason. I'm communicating to you telepathically. Can you hear me? Mason? What's going on? You're asleep right now, and I need you to wake up. Vanessa, wake up. Hey, it's okay. Let me see your wrist. Why? I'm gonna take that bracelet off of you so you can use your powers. And then, we're gonna take down Damien. We need to take down Damien. If you don't like Damien, then why do you work for him? I was a special kid, just like you. A freak, as they call us. But your label says scientist. I know. Damien changed it for me. And in exchange, I worked for him. But now, after many years, I see that- What he's doing is wrong. Yeah, exactly. Go find your friend Casey and set her free. And my parents? I have to save them too. Vanessa, about your parents, they- They what? There isn't enough time. Damien's almost back. Just go. I'll try and open the doors for you. Casey? How are you free? There's no time to explain. Come on, we gotta go save my parents. They're in this room. Are you sure? Yes, I- I can feel them. Mason should be unlocking the door any minute. Okay. Hey, what are you two doing? Somebody stop her! Vanessa? <laughs> no, you idiot! You shot the special one! Vanessa! You said to stop her! Vanessa, stay with me. My parents, you- You have to save my parents. Damien's gonna be back any minute. If she dies, we're all dead. Wait, you have healing powers. No, I can't. I can't heal people that are this injured. Sure you can. Casey, no, don't. 
No, she's flatlining. Save her right now. But I told you I can't... We said do it. Okay, please wait. I'll try. It's working. She's healing her. There, she's safe. Casey! This is all your fault. Whoa, hey, calm down before we turn on the red lights. Not gonna happen. Oh, come on, let's go. Wait, but first we have to help Casey. She's barely breathing. Oh man, I mean, I don't know what to- The only one who can save your friend is me. You save my friend or else- Or else what? I still have your parents. Let's not forget who has the leverage here. I'll consider saving your friend if you come with me. Vanessa, go with him. I have a plan. Now you're gonna be a good girl and stay right there while I- Hey! Oh. That's enough. <sighs> don't you hurt her, Damien. She's the threat here, Mason. Not me. Which is why I have to do to her what I did to her parents. Oh, Damien, don't you dare. It has to be done. This shot is going to put you into a little coma. But don't worry, it won't hurt. One day I'll learn how to control you freaks. But until then, good night. Mason, not so fast. Over here, Damien. What? How did you get free? Vanessa, get up now. No, Vanessa, don't- <laughs> You're never gonna get that door open. Ugh. Vanessa, are you alright? I'll go get Casey, you get your parents. <sighs> Mom? Dad? <sighs> Please wait. Can you hear me? How dare you! Take her away from me! Where? Where is she? Mom, it's me! Vanessa? I'm sorry. My baby, is it really you? Hey, I got Casey and a van we can take to get out of here. Uh, what's going on? Don't worry. You guys are safe now. Happy birthday! We got you something! I think I know what it is. An iPhone 4 toy pencils. pencils. Really? Honey, they're magic pencils. Right. Class, write this down. Purple power unlocked. Hey babe, do you mind if we take a rain check on our date this week? Are you nervous? <laughs> what, what? No, of course not. Are you hiding something from me? Crap, I can't do this anymore. I cheated on you, okay? I'm sorry. I feel so bad you and your boyfriend broke up. This tells me people's emotions. You're not sad. I don't know what you're talking about. She was jealous of us. I knew it. Hey, um, where's mom? She's outside with Coco giving her a lecture about listening. Coco, when mommy says stop, you say okay. I'm just a baby! Mom, you might not want to talk to her right now. But you still had to say okay, mom. I'm just a baby! I think today I'm gonna go with red. Red power unlocked. I get to see people's ages. Well, this will be interesting. Hey, good morning, girly. You're 20? What? How did you find out? Never mind that, but why are you still in high school? I failed. I got held back. Hey, it's okay. Your secret is safe with me. Hey, I'm new. Is it cool if I sit here? Yeah, of course. Thanks. So, how old are you? Me? Oh, uh, I just turned 17 about, like, uh, two months ago. Psst, hey, what? Do you believe in vampires? No, why? Because I think I'm sitting next to one. Huh? You're funny. I'm telling you, he's a hundred years old. Can you watch my bag? I gotta use the restroom. Yeah, sure. See, he's- Girl, what are you doing? Looking for evidence. Ew, what is that? I think this is- What the hell, dude? What are you doing with my stuff? What are you doing with my stuff? Well, I think the better question is, what are you doing with this? That's for my lunch. It's strawberry jam. Oh! <laughs> Can I have my stuff back? Yeah, sorry. Yesterday's power was kind of a disaster, so today I think I'm going to go with green. Green power unlocked. Let's hope this power helps me figure out if that guy is a vampire or not. Hey, so I just wanted to apologize about yesterday. You're good. I actually think you're kind of cute. <laughs> How old did you say you were again? Seventeen. I'm throwing a party tonight. Wanna come? Yeah, sure. I would love that. Sweet. I'll airdrop you my address. Hey, you made it. Yeah, but where is everyone? They're on their way. 
Hey, Mom, this is the girl I was telling you about. Ooh, she looks beautifully delicious. Stop it. Really, I could just eat you. Oh, no. Try my punch, darling. The flavor is to die for. Get back. I'm leaving. Wait. I have two vampires after me. This calls for some extreme powers. What would happen if I just picked all of them? Are you sure you want to combine all the pencil's power? I have to. Wish mode activated. There you are. Please, don't be scared. I know you know I'm a vampire, and I'm sorry about lying about the party. Your mom was trying to... kill me. I was just trying to hang out with you alone. I didn't realize she was going to act like that. She has bloodlust. I wish you were a vampire so you can understand. Wish granted. What just happened? I think you just turned me into a vampire. How is that even possible? Because I have a secret too, okay? I have magic colored pencils, and I think you just used the last of their power. You don't have to worry about my mom killing you anymore. Thank you, because that makes me feel so much better. Hey, since I did this to you, I promise I'll protect you. I'll teach you how to be a great vampire. Please wish for me to pass my test! What? No! Leave me alone! How do you have one wish left? Everyone used theirs up as kids! Well, I was a very smart child, and I saved mine. Hey, looking nice today. Do you want to sit next to me for lunch? Sure. You know, my car broke down today. Oh, so this is why you wanted to sit with me? No, I mean, I wanted to- Save it, Grayson. You just want to use me like everyone else. Can you please wish for- Stop it. Everywhere I go, people are asking me for wishes like I'm some sort of genie. So you know what? I wish for everyone to have three more wishes. Hey, I didn't get any more. What happened? I wish for you to stop talking. Mmm! I have unlimited wishes. Bro, she can give us anything we want. <gasps> get her! She has infinite wishes. Get her! I wish I was home. Honey, you're home early. Yeah, I actually got unlimited. Uh-huh, that's nice. Are you even listening to me? Sorry, can't hear you. I wish for her to take her AirPods off and to smash them on the floor. <gasps> Why did I just do that? Hey, it's Wish Girl. I have a name. Yeah, but no one cares. Now give us wishes. Oh, I don't think so. I wish for everyone at this school to forget that I have unlimited wishes. Wait, what was I talking to you about? Don't move. I wish. Uh-uh. Don't even think about it. Read what's on the paper. I am not reading this. Read it or things are gonna get ugly. I wish to become a genie? Great. Now come with me. Where are we? Your new home. What? How do you even know me? Someone at your school told me yesterday. Oh man, I should have wished for everyone to forget sooner. You're gonna give me wishes. Not gonna happen. Oh, yes it is. I wish to be a billionaire. You must hold hand to activate wish. Oh, okay. Come here. No way. I just got a billion dollars in my account. Now I wish for a horse. <laughs> nice. Now I wish for a Rolex watch. Can I please take a break now? I'm tired. You're lucky I'm a nice guy. All right, you can have a little break. Come on. You know, when I said I wanted to sit down, this wasn't what I meant. Enough complaining. Don't make me wish for you not to speak. <sighs> what am I gonna do? I wish that I was free. Error. You may only grant wishes for others. Psst, Melanie. Grayson? What are you doing here? I saw that guy take you, so I followed you. Why didn't you just call the police? Oh, maybe I should have done that. Okay, I'll go call them right now. No, 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 wait. Actually, you can help me. All you have to do is just say one wish. What? A wish? Just wish for me not to be a genie anymore. But everyone used up all their- Damn it, Grayson. Just repeat after me. I wish- I wish- For Melanie to not be a genie anymore. For Melanie not to be a genie anymore. Hey, I wish for him to disappear. That's not gonna work. I wish I was free. Out of wishes. Okay, guess that's not gonna work either. <laughs> Grayson, a little help, please. What are you gonna do, kid, huh? I was thinking of doing this. Ooh. That's what you get, creep. You okay? Yeah. Oh, here. The cops found these on him. Thanks. I guess those Taekwondo classes really paid off. Yeah, but can you explain what the genie stuff was all about? You know, I wish I could, but I think it's best if I don't. It's him. Good morning, Angel. Good morning, Charlie. Are you ready for your next assignment? Yes, sir. We thought you'd never ask. Please tell me it doesn't involve scuba diving this time. Yeah, I just got my nails done. Actually, that's perfect because you're going to be going undercover at a high-end hotel. How high-end? The Four Seasons. Fancy. We'll go get ready. Does everyone remember what the target looks like? Burnett male with green eyes. 
Um, 5'10", and there's a gold chain on his neck. Correct, and I think I just found him. Hola, ¿cómo estás? Whoa, hey, sweetheart. Okay, the tracker is activated. Entendido. Huh? I can't understand you. Nada, nada. Make your move, Bree. Ay, estoy cansada. Ah, oh, sweetheart, are you tired? Come rest in my suite. And then after, you can give me a little Spanish lesson. <laughs> Careful, Bree. He could be tricking you. So what do you say? Can't speak English, but you understand? See. Si. Interesting. I don't like this. She shouldn't have went up to his room. Would you relax? If she needs help, all she has to do is ask. Why can't I hear her anymore? I don't know. I've lost a signal. You're a good kisser, sweetheart. But, uh, can I ask you something? What kind of tracker is this? Did you think I wouldn't notice you putting it on my neck? No comprendo. Yeah, yeah, cut the act, okay? I already know you can speak English. Fine, you got me. Let me see your hands. Whoa, take it easy. Listen, you're gonna start to feel a little funny right about now. I wore something special for you when we kissed. Great. Do you read me? Something is wrong. We have to go after her. You're right. Let's go. Let's find out who you really are. Wake up. Morning, Sleeping Beauty. I got some questions to ask you. Okay, who do you work for? Don't feel like talking anymore, huh? I think I can change that. Freeze! Drop what's in your hands now. I got a better idea. How about you two drop what's in your hands and I don't hurt your friend? Okay, okay. You too, Blondie. We surrender. Smart friend. <sighs> What are you two? Oh. Oh. I think it's someone's nap time. <laughs> I'm sending this to Charlie. Bree, are you alright? Yeah, thanks guys. I'm sorry the mission didn't go as planned, Charlie. Girls, it's alright. I'm just glad everyone is okay. Yeah, and at least now Mr. Crazy can be brought in for questioning. Exactly. I'm so proud of you angels. Want to see your boyfriend's feelings? 100%? Guess he's a keeper. Got this for you. Thanks. Of course, babe. Derek, is that you? Olivia. You two know each other? Yeah, we used to... Date. We were together for a little bit. We should all go out sometime. Yeah, we should. Boyfriend lost a little feelings. Hey, babe, do you maybe want to hang out tonight? Oh, sorry, babe. I already invited the boys over. They'll be here in a little bit. It's game night. More feelings lost. What is going on? You know what? Forget it. I don't care if it's boys' night. I have to go talk to him. Derek, I... <gasps> oh! Holy shit! Is she wearing my... Um, we we can explain. You should have knocked. Ugh. Want to get revenge on your boyfriend? Pick your revenge for boyfriend. Revenge is ready. Take your revenge. Remember to use it wisely. Hey, can we talk? There is nothing to talk about. You and I are over. No, don't say that, okay? I just found out that Olivia is with another guy. Well, you know what they say. Karma is a real... Maria, please. What I did was stupid, and I promise it's not going to happen again. I want you, not her. Thanks for giving me a second chance. Of course. I'm not one to hold a grudge. You look so beautiful, babe. Thanks. Babe, I gotta tell you, this food is, like, really good. I'm glad you like it. I made it myself. What? I didn't know you could cook. You even got my favorite drink. Should we make a toast? To us. To us. Oh, babe, I hope you don't mind I switched our drinks. The one you gave me smelt a little strong. Whoa. You switched them? Yeah, I didn't think it was that big of a deal. <laughs> You've been coughing a lot. Are you okay? You know what? I'm gonna go get you some water. Your revenge has backfired. Yeah, no shit, Sherlock. Would you like to receive the antidote? Is that even a question? Yes. Sorry I took so long, babe. Here you go. Thanks. What a hero. Boyfriend has lost a little feelings. That boy gains and loses feelings for me every five seconds. Olivia? What the hell are you doing here? It's Derek. He's in the hospital. Haven't you checked your phone? He got into a car accident. Derek? Bria, you came. 
Oh, I'm so glad I'll have you to take care of me. Actually, no, you won't. Because I'm breaking up with you. What? No! Please. It's like I said, Derek. Karma. It's a real bit. Hey, make a wish. How many years did it give you? Ten. She has to get married at 17? She won't even be an adult. Don't worry, my dear. We'll find her a good prince to marry. Besides, she doesn't seem like she's gonna be the picky type. <laughs> Your 17th birthday is in one week and you still have not chosen a prince to marry. That's because princes are stuck up and all they care about is money and power. Maria, that's not true. Not all princes are like that. Well, Mother said that when I find the right guy, my days left will turn from red to green. That is a myth, princess. And you are running out of time. But luckily, I'm available. I think I'd rather die, Jay. You will if you don't choose someone. I am not going to let that happen. If you don't pick someone in the next few days to marry, I will have no choice but to have you married to Jay. What? No! My word is final, Maria. Princess Maria, there's someone here to see you. Excuse me, princess. My name is Prince Adam. Well, hello, Prince Adam. Oh my gosh, he is so hot. Could the prince and I please get some privacy? Oh, yes, of course. Sorry about that. No worries, princess. So, I'm guessing my father sent you up here? Well, you seem like a very nice guy. And I would like to get to know you, but... I just wish that I wasn't being forced to marry someone right now. I completely understand. That is why I want to help you. Help me? Yes. Have you heard of the legend of the Wishing Rock? Yes, my mother used to tell me stories of it all the time. I want to find it for you, so you may wish to be married whenever you please. You... you would do that? Of course. This system isn't fair, and I want to make you happy. I will be back with your Wishing Rock in three days' time. Thank you. You... you don't know how much this means to me. Princess, I'm back. Unfortunately, I could not find the rock. I think we should get married instead. But what about the system not being fair? You said you were going to help me. You're not Prince Adam, are you? Of course it is me, Princess. Who else would it be? I'm telling you, Father, that isn't him. No, you're just saying that because you don't want to get married. You didn't want to marry Jay, so I found you this nice prince. I know, but my day's left turned back to red, and remember Mother said- Your mother is gone. And I will not lose you two over your stubbornness to settle on a man. You and Adam are to be married tomorrow at sunset. You can't do that. Don't insult my authority, Maria. My word is always final. Why the sad face, princess? Leave me alone, Jay. Perhaps you'd rather talk to Prince Adam. Better? How did you- I stole the wishing rock. And if you don't do exactly as I say, you will never see Prince Adam again. Too bad this rock can't make people fall in love. It also can't bring people back from the dead either. Such a shame. I really did like your mother. Where is Adam? He'll be fine as long as you cooperate. Guards! I wish for her to fall asleep until tomorrow. Now to take care of your father. Wake up, princess. Time to get ready. You look gorgeous. I've waited for this day for so long. Maria. Adam? How did you- I escaped. Hurry. We don't have much time before they notice. Jay has taken control of everyone, and he's going to execute your father. What? Don't worry. I have a plan. What is it you wanted to do before our wedding, Maria? This. Oh! Now, Adam. Oh. Make your wish. I wish that I... I wish that all princesses could be married whenever they please. Are you alright? I think so. Hey, you have infinite time now. I do? Yes, look. Oh my gosh, I do. Adam, you're amazing. Thank you, but I couldn't have done this without your help as well. Wait, what about my father? Quick, use the wishing rock. I wish my father was in this room. Maria! Oh my god, you were right about Jay. You were right about everything. I should have never yelled at you hey, like that. Hey, it's okay. Everything's alright now. I'm free. Your time, it's infinite. You use the wishing rock? Oh, Maria, come here. I'm so sorry for everything. So, what will you do with the rock? I'm going to lock it away, somewhere safe. This much power isn't good for anyone. I guess I should be going, Princess.